In Backup Exec 2012, I'm going to show you how to set up the reporting. From here, we'll just go ahead and in the upper left corner, click on the icon, go to Configuration and Settings, go to Backup Exec Settings, and on the left hand side we see some defaults here. Click on Reports. You can change the reports from HTML to PDF. Some email has a hard time looking at HTML. Some uh, older computer systems may have a hard time reading it, so you can change that to PDF if you'd like. It's also more compressed that way. The maximum number of rows to include in a report is by default 10,000, so if you don't want the report to be that long, you can change that size right here. You can show all rows or you can show distinct rows, and again, this will just show basically the highlights of what's going on in the reports as opposed to all of them. You can use a special image file if you want, just by clicking on the Use the Custom Image File and then browsing to that file. Instead of seeing this, the default uh, icon that shows up in the reports, you can also set banner colors to make things easier to read by categories and you can choose the color of your choice for each of these different banners. Down at the bottom we can set up the footer text so you can have a message that says something at the bottom and you can also include the time. Definitely want to include the time that does help in the reports. And when you're done you can click OK.